into the free. Poached by world champion Angelika Kridova, Alisa Agafanova, and Alba Uka from Turkey. First ice dance couple ever to represent Turkey at the Olympics when they went to Sochi. Choosing to do a combination lift. Most teams choosing to do shorter lifts, this team going for the long lift. Lovely to watch. Elisa Agafanova and Alba Uka. And these two are a real skaters' favorites, popular couple off the ice amongst the other ice dance teams, he in particular. And I think that one of the, the, the older dance teams in the event, certainly their 
focus is to aim towards their second Olympic Games in Pyeongchang. He'll be 33 by the time that the next Olympics roll around. And I think they're at a difficult time, Simon, because ice dance is such a strong event and their physical match, obviously she's very tall. And when you actually look at this team, her leg length is actually longer than him. So it's not the ideal physical match for an ice dance team, which makes it a little bit more tricky when they're coming through some of these difficult elements. But they cope with it well. They, they've got level four elements within the program. Like I said, they chose to do the, the long lift, a combination of straight line and rotational lift. Couple who seem to be going nowhere. Only 21st in Boston, having been 16th the previous year in Japan. And so that's where th this know, is a vital year. It, it really, really is. And that's when it's challenging when you are faced with some of those physical, not disabilities, but challenges. But they cope very well here there in their straight line lift, which leads into the rotation of slight loss of grip and the, the arm lock here. She changes position. That's one of the, the features to attain a higher level for the dance teams. And this too, you'll see many of the, the dance teams twizzle with their leg extended. It has to be at a 45 degree angle or higher for it to be counted by the technical panel. Janet Coton, British judge, will be scrutinizing that as a technical controller. And there, they're with, they're in great hands, coaching team, Pasquale Carmelengo. And we're very lucky in the UK to have had him presenting at our National Coaches Conference. A wealth of expertise given to the UK coaches. As they skate out of Detroit, Akvanova used to compete for Ukraine before switching to Turkey. Ah, now that's interesting, they've dropped. Fourth place for them.